how can we delete blank rows in our Excel table? With the small document like that, we could actually just right click on the number of the row, so row number three, and pick delete. But that's usually not the case. Usually we got really large tables, large data sets. So in that case, select your table, select your range, or in case it's really huge, you can select the whole document like that by clicking here at the corner. In my case, I got this table here. And then we're going to use F5. We need to trigger go to function. So I click F5 and I got this go to window. I will click special because I want to go to blanks only. So I click blanks and confirm with OK. And now all of those blank rows are selected. So if I go to the top and click delete, they will be gone. So it's a really effective option because it will select all of the rows for you. You don't need to search for them. But you must be careful because if you got incomplete data set, let me show you that. I will undo. Let's say this cell for the name here is empty. If you got incomplete data set like this and we use the same function, so we click F5, special, go to blanks, OK. It's also select that blank cell. So if I click delete now, I also delete that whole incomplete row. So keep in mind this method is only effective when you got complete rows. No blanks in cells. So in that case, you will need to develop some kind of formula to determine that those rows should be deleted or no. That will be covered in another video. I hope this will be helpful for you and I will see you in the next lesson. Bye.